Welcome back to TCM. I'm Alicia Malone and all this month we've been watching films that are out of this world. And amongst those we've shown some very iconic sci-fi films. And iconic is definitely a term I'd use to describe our next film along with hugely influential and immensely popular. From 1977 it's Star Wars Episode 4 A New Hope. This is the fourth episode, but the first Star Wars film released, which gave birth to a cinematic empire, one that is still continuing. This story follows Luke Skywalker, played by Mark Hamill, who teams up with pilot Han Solo, Harrison Ford, and his sidekick Wookiee called Chewbacca, played by the late Peter Mayhew, and two droids to try to rescue Princess Leia, played by Carrie Fisher, and save the galaxy from the evil Darth Vader. At the time this film was released, director George Lucas had found success with American graffiti, but not yet in the sci-fi genre. His debut feature, THX 1138, was not a hit, and Lucas had wanted to remake the classic sci-fi film Flash Gordon, but he couldn't get the rights. So he decided to create his own world by combining many of his favourite genres, films and influences, from samurai films like Akira Kurosawa's The Hidden Fortress to westerns like The Searchers. Once he completed the script, Lucas shopped it around, but Universal, United Artists and Disney all said no. Their lack of faith was disturbing, but Alan Ladd Jr. at 20th Century Fox decided to give Lucas a chance and a final budget of roughly $10 million. And with that, Lucas made cinematic history. From 1977, Star Wars Episode 4, A New Hope. 